the Hall of Famer, Kurt Angle. The following contest is an elimination match. Making his way to the ring from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, weighing in at 237 pounds, Kurt Angle. A man who will take on any competitor on any night. Yeah, Kurt Angle considers the entire locker room an open challenge. And from New York, weighing in at 230 pounds, Paul. Ladies and gentlemen, his name is Paul Heyman, and he's up next. Oh, man, I hope he knows what he's getting himself into. A man who elevates his game every week. He is competing at his highest level yet. The CEO about to conduct some business. And from Greenwich, Connecticut, weighing in at 248 pounds, Mr. McMahon. I mean, think about it, guys. He's a former Royal Rumble winner. He's held the ECW and WWE World Championships. A true inspiration in every sense of the word. A man who always considers himself main event material, an uncrowned champion. He wants to show exactly why here tonight. It's all about the money. It's all about high risk. It's Shane O'Mac in the house. And from New York City, weighing in at 235 pounds, Shane McMahon. Well, Shane McMahon was born with a silver spoon, but there's no doubt we'll take any risk to win.
We'll stop at nothing to win here tonight. Shadow back. Here comes the game. The COO of WWE, but also a man who is absolutely dominant inside that ring. Something tells me we're about to see what's best for business. And from Greenwich, Connecticut, weighing in at 255 pounds, the game, Triple H. Nobody possesses a higher in-ring IQ than the Cerebral Assassin. Well, think about it. Every tactic, every trick, every technique you can think of, Triple H has mastered. Yeah, the game will stop at nothing. He'll use every tool at his disposal to win the matchup. That is why he has become maybe the greatest of all time. Now the intimidation and mind games have already begun for Triple H. Because the moment the music hits, Triple H begins to defend his kingdom. Well, that's because Triple H looks at every competitor as a threat to his crown. We are about to see a battle here tonight. The GM is in the building. It's Adam Pierce. And from Lake Forest, Illinois, weighing in at 245 pounds, Adam Pierce. You are looking at some highly motivated competitors in this match, looking to steal the show and capture the attention of the entire WWE Universe. Adam Pearce looks like he's ready to show the WWE Universe that he's more than just a general manager. destruction the WWE Universe finally able to look into the eyes of fear itself and from the pits of hell weighing in at 323 pounds Kane. you know for years WWE fans wondered what was under the mask now they probably regret even asking what was under the mask Pure evil in the eyes of the big red machine. Oh, and those flames were hot. Teddy Long! 
Hey, where's the horse? What are you talking about? Yeah, what horse? The high horse this superstar always seems to be on. Did Jerry Lawler write that line for you? He says it's all about dominance tonight and plans on showing why everyone backstage should be scared. The ring is packed as this eight-way match gets started here. Will be seven losers in one very Rokita Clutch! It's the sleeper hold! And it looks like the clutch is in. This one could be over. Oh, breaking the grip, breaking the grip, breaking the hold! And that was a well-executed attack. Sharp punch! Ooh, what a damaging blow! That was just disrespectful. An agile escape. Counters, this could be an opportunity. And a well-executed move we just saw there. Corey, what's your best shot at winning in a no disqualification match? You lean into the stipulation and leave no stone unturned. Use everything at your disposal to get the win. Otherwise, what's the point? And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. Boom! Release German. Ooh, tagged with a punch. Both competitors showing how well they know one another. And he's able to counter. He's back into the ring. Shane McMahon manages the counter. And that was an efficient display of offense with that maneuver. Kane gets that set right back to him. Back elbow completely cuts them off. He's staring his opponent down, getting into that zone. Paying it right back with a reversal. Oh, look at this here, guys. Look at this. Each competitor showing they've done their homework. Into the chop block, a debilitating counter there. Some good contact by Paul Heyman. Reversal! Can he take advantage? Every maneuver being returned with counter fire. Suplex! Launched. He's taking some good hits. Reversal from the game. Soul kick. He went right into that turnbuckle. Pinpointing the leg. Ooh, great response to Pierce there. All the way over. With the Lariat. What a shot. Ooh, that's going to leave a mark. Coming back in the ring. No, oh, so called dentist. Tiger suplex. He's setting something up. Oh, foot just stomping down. Turning the tables. Whatever you can do. Triple A looking to end this match. And that definitely made solid impact. That's the game changer. And talk about giving a DDT with authority. Oh, look at this. What a headbutt. Counters into a brutal clubbing blow. And that was a precisely measured attack. As the leg trap, Fisherman Suplex. I have to say, I feel like we are just one move away from claiming a winner in this one. One more move or one more misstep, either one can do it. Look at that. Right. on its way. This is right for and imagine if his own move leads to his downfall. Yeah, no. Okavat sleeper is in. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. This will win the match. But... He's clearly desperately trying to get out of this situation. A oh, great counter. What a match. What a match. A sledgehammer. How do you recover from that? Shifts it back onto him. And that was an effective attack. All the way. Straight to hell. Does Heyman have any fight left? He is obviously taking way too much pleasure in this right now. Kane gets out of the way. Okay, he's re-entering the ring. And well-timed maneuver there. I can see up to the rafters and there's not a single person sitting down. What an environment this is. All eyes are glued on this battle. Down in a hurry. 
Angle with a spectacular single leg into the ankle lock. And we just saw some serious offense. Oh, I'm going to tap out here. He is in serious trouble here and finds his way out. He moves just in time. Avoids that one. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. That was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. Float over. Oh, into it. Float over. Nice. DDT. Kurt Angle picks the leg. Looking to end this hit. Hey, watch this. He wanted him, but maybe he has something better planned. And that was taking the attack to the competition with that one. The admiration for these superstars is echoing throughout this arena right now. And that was offense with a powerful purpose. Great defense by Heyman. And that was an efficient form of offense with that move. Wow, he reversed angle. Kane with the grip. All the way up. And that was a precisely measured attack. Is that what it takes to beat Mr. McMahon? Backbreaker. Oh, what a close. to their feet and a thunderous right hand. Comes back into the ring. He's certainly lining him up, but he's wasting too much time. Ooh, fought back with an elbow right to the jaw. Oh! Loving blow. Spiked with a urinagi. Driven down. Textbook jumping clothesline. Oof. What a shot. Saw it coming and slowed it down with the back elbow. Sent into the corner. Ugh, gets put into the barricade. Superman punching the corner. Has been eliminated. He steps foot in the ring again. Oh, yes, this eliminated. Mr. McMahon finds his target with that one. The game with the double underhook here. Uh oh. Evil to reverse. Superman punch. Oh, look out. And the spear. Is that what it takes to beat Mr. McMahon? Great reversal. Oh, Ooh, what a knee lift. Somebody better check his nose. The end is looming now. Yeah, this is a dire situation right now. Look at this. They're setting him up. Double suplex. Kane turns it around. Knee right to the gut. And Heyman is now looking frail in the late going. Kane has the advantage here. DDT plants them. Able to elude it. Oh, man. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Oh, watch this, fellas. Into the barricade. Hits to the corner like that will render you useless. Guys, they are getting way too close for comfort here. Yeah, I've seen this before, and it doesn't end well. He saw that one coming. Boom! A forearm smack! It's always disorienting taking those hits above the shoulders. Ooh! Setting foot in the ring now. Ah, uh, here you go! Pedigree! Triple H has this all sewn up. 
Uh-oh. Well-placed elbow to break up the maneuver. These two having an answer for everything. Oh, my goodness. And that was offense with a hurtful purpose. And what's he looking for here? He's got a kendo stick, a weapon we've seen used to great effect time and time again. Ooh, got caught with a punch to the face. Score point, pinning combination. Oh, maybe not. What power. Kendo stick to the skull. Oh, man. And Kane still showing some fire in this matchup. This could be a very dangerous moment for Triple H. He has been here before, and he knows what he needs to do. Oh, Ooh, what a knee lift. Somebody better check his nose. Could be some collateral damage on the way here. Everyone needs to clear out, including us. Taking this outside. This could be good. Caught with a punch. He'll take things into the ring. And we just saw some serious offense. He got it. Like well, that sledgehammer can cause some serious damage. Bang! Battling at ringside can be very unforgiving. You have to be careful out there. No protection out here. No safe confines to speak of. And he sends him into the corner. Oh, God, that hurt. Oh. Oh, and he stays ahead of Triple H. Quick back elbow detours that offense. Quick exchange of counters there. Paul in his... Uh oh Fought back with a punch to the gut. And what need is there to go looking under the apron like this? Power! Uh-oh! Pedigree! Oh, he's got to do it. That's got to be it. All the way up and down and down with the choke slam. The game down might be it for Triple H. He's heading up top. Thinking big. He's reeling, slowly getting up. From the top. Counter. And now there's an opening. Ooh. to the swift chop block. Heads out and he has all the time he wants. If you're going to grab a kendo stick, you better be prepared to use it. Out of the ring, what's his plan here? Backbreaker. And we see him take yet another shot to the body. And well-timed maneuver there. Drop kick right on point. Oh! That's it. Calling it by knockout. Here is your winner, Kane! And that was certainly no easy task, surviving against the rest of their competition in this match. Yeah, you cannot discount just how much endurance went into coming out on top in a match like this.